Hey, how are you doing? I'm right over here. So this girl, Nelly Twikong, who of course has been everywhere in your world, has not seen me in a year. Nelly is Pauline Cosmetics, but you'll catch up as we go along. Since we spoke, what has been going on with you? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I had to sigh. It has been a whirlwind. Uh -huh. It has been literally one thing after the next. Uh -huh. um, where do I start? It was, I'll start with the beginning of the year, mm -hmm. actually towards the end of 2017 um, to beginning of 2018. I mm -hmm. spent a lot of time with, the, with my contract manufacturers working on new products, some that I was meant to launch. This mm -hmm. year. I will come to that. <laughs> and, uh, and some that are coming next year. And actually last year, um, you know, I knew I needed to do certain things to get to the next level. Mm -hmm. um, and so some of the opportunities that came along were things that I think I have been ready for. Like? So on the personal front mm -hmm. would be, uh, say, BYOB, right? Oh, yes. Yes. So I got a chance to be on BYOB. Mm -hmm. Uh, I was nominated a uh, Women in Business Award. Oh. Yes. Um, I think it's an event by uh, Chambers of Commerce. Yes. Um, I got top 10, uh, top 40, under 40. You better have a nominated you. Yes, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Um, so the award was, uh, the, 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 I think they, they did the nominations last year, and mm -hmm. the award uh, mm -hmm. ceremony was this, this year. This year, yeah. Um, I got published in a book. Um, it's called How We Made It in Africa. Whoa. Which um, I think is powered by DHL. Mm -hmm. And this guy literally compiled 27 stories of entrepreneurs in Africa. And I was so honored to be one of those people. So which brings study. me to something I need to ask you. Mm -hmm. What have you learned over the last year as an entrepreneur? Stuff that you thought initially, I'm going to do this. I'm going to do this. I'm the, and then you got there and you're like, mm, wait. Mm -hmm. Um, one has been, um, to, cause then we, you want to do so much mm -hmm. and that can be overwhelming. And when you're overwhelmed, you're not going to move forward and no, of course you're not, not going to execute, uh, the right way. At the same time, I've also learned, and especially this happened mostly in 2017. Mm -hmm. Um, and, and I remember looking in 2016 and thinking, what did I need to do in 2017 to get mm -hmm. us to the next level? And it was just dive in go in just do it um and i've even called you a few times yes <laughs> i'm like for heaven's sake do it yeah yes so it, it was i remember a quote um uh fortune favors the bold yes and i i had to most of the time one maybe get permission from somebody to say okay go go do it nobody's gonna um, give you permission but but I, I i knew i needed to be bold and and execute on really bold ideas like this like this yes so it has been most of the biggest lesson has been just do it wow and, and i know we say it we see oh it. yeah we, we see, see it, it but we don't do it but it clicked it's one of those you know when the when the when the student is ready the teacher will show kind of situation and okay it, it made sense, it made sense. It. you were ready and then the lessons showed up mm -hmm. incidentally you've never seen me look like this and it's because Nelly was like, how are we doing this conversation? And you're not wearing uh, Pauline cosmetics. So I am. I'm wearing the foundation, everything. Powder. Down to my favorite lip color. Yeah. And this is? Foxy. Foxy. Mm. Yeah, mm. Yeah, 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 that's what it was called. <laughs> Actually, yeah, what was the reaction to my conversation with you? I love reading a lot of the comments. Yes. Yes. So I also loved reading them because mm -hmm. I remember you being like, have you seen the comments? Yes. Um, one, it was just warm and wonderful to see the response and the support. Mm -hmm. um, and at the same time, it was us getting calls of, I want Caroline's brush. Yeah, the I one she likes. Trends, Which one I, is that? I want, I want a Caroline's and lipstick. Yes. Yes. Um, so that was amazing. We definitely saw a spike in sales, especially that one. I, I mm, yeah, you, you sent me the numbers, yes. Um, and we were at the office being like, whoa. What just happened? Can we get her to do this every month? <laughs> <laughs> no. Um, but, but have you grown? I know there were distributors who didn't want to talk to you. They were like, it's Kenyan. And, and I, I feel like that was a conversation that helped me be like, it's all right if you don't want it. Um, <laughs> 
<laughs> uh, it's okay. I mean, if, if Caroline likes it, so. Yeah, you too bad. Like yeah, too bad. Um, but at the same time, yes, we've gotten more people calling to say, I want to stock this product. So it did, you know, it gives you some level of, um, you know, confidence, but also sweet cred. You know, oh so really? Kind of so have you have you been able to spread your wings outside Nairobi? We have. So even at that time, we were stocked in um, countrywide. So Nairobi, um, Naivasha, Nakuru, Thika, Mombasa, Nyali, uh -huh. uh, Kisumu, Eldoret. So uh -huh. the major cities. Wow. But what we've done now, what has happened since, is that we have expanded distribution in those places. Oh wow. So. Of course, new business there. Mm -hmm. A lot no, of people yes. who maybe were, mm, we don't know, now they're like, okay, fine, let's partner up and do business. So that has definitely opened up a lot of, okay. a lot of doors. Okay. I guess what I need to know, you, you will take a break and go and make sure that you know, you're well powdered. Um, we will talk about what I'm wearing. It's very important. And then we'll talk about what took so long for this to happen. Mm -hmm. Because from the time the conversation started to when I finally saw it, I was like, well, it has been a minute. Yeah. Does it does it really take that long, or is it a learning curve for you? It was one. It it's a new product. I've never done this kind of product. Lipsticks, you know, I have it yes. down. Uh, but still, it was the learning curve of a new product, mm -hmm. and just the uncertainty that goes with making something. Think. Yeah. Okay. We'll talk about that. Subscribe and come back. And if you've never tried anything from Pauline Cosmetics, you've seen it at Super Cosmetics and all the places you go to. Pick one up. Pick up Foxy. Pick up Foxy. Love it this Christmas. Okay? Fantastic. Fantastic.